Yo, what is going on guys and welcome back to the channel I'm showing you how to obtain the Checker Tron top in GD5 Online after the patch of 1.39. This is very easy guys and if you've watched them on the videos I have been uploading uh, this past week, you may know the method that we will be using in today's video which is uh, pretty easy guys when you get used to it. But before we get into this video guys make sure you drop this video a like, also subscribe to the channel so you get this content and in the future to this. And make sure you turn the post notification on if you are new to the channel so you will notify whenever I upload a brand GTA 5 video like this. But anyway guys, let's get straight into today's video. So here's everything we will be making into this video guys. It's this uh, checkered Tron top, which has this like pinkish uh, checkered part to it, which is quite cool guys. So it's really unique as well. And uh, this is just a little bit of disclaimer before we get into this. You will lose your outfits when doing this glitch. So if you like your outfits, then don't do this glitch guys because it will wipe all your outfits. Um, so the first one to do guys is you want to make sure you have a female character and you want to go to any clothing shop on the map and you want to put on the patched darted uh, biker cut and when you have put in the uh, patched darted biker cut all you want to do is you want to go down to bus or whatever it's called it should be the thing on uh, the 39th um, option and you want to put on one of these ones that I'm showing you right now in the gameplay the white one gives you the black one and the others do different things. The red one gives you that pinkish colour that I did show you. Uh, but you can experiment around with them and you can get some really cool combinations with it. But when you have put this on guys, you want to just go ahead and go to the pants section. And you want to put on the black cropped jeans. As you can see we don't know in the video. Uh, make sure you do have some money on your account as well because you will need to spend uh, a little bit of money with these outfits. And you want to go to the shoes section, and you want to go to high heels, and you want to put on the charcoal platforms. And then once you have gone ahead and put on the charcoal platforms, you want to go over to glasses, and you want to go to casual glasses, and you want to put on the copper marbles. This gives you the checkered uh, glasses as well, and the black cup jeans give you the checkered pants. And then all you want to do is you want to go over the hat section, then canvas hats, and you want to put on the grey paid uh, canvas uh, hat. Um, as you can see right here, it gives you the, the canvas uh, checker tie as well guys, but when you have got all, all those components put on your outfit, all you want to do is you want to save as an outfit, then you want to switch to your male character, as you can see you're doing out in the video. Then when you have loaded into GA5 online, all you want to do from here is you want to switch to Michael or Franklin, then when you have loaded in as Michael or Franklin, all you want to do is you want to go in direct mode. When you have went in direct mode guys, all you want to do is you want to go to actors, and you want to go to online characters and you want to select your first GTA Online character which should be a male character that you did load in as. And when you have selected your first GTA Online character all you want to do is you want to walk around in direct mode for around about a few seconds. It should be like 20 seconds or something like that guys. And when you have walked around for 20 seconds all you want to do is you want to down the d-pad and you want to go back to the little trailer icon. Um, as you can see what you're doing right now in the video. Then once you have hit the little trailer icon and you are back at the trailer, all you want to do from here is you want to find a recent activity to clean a bounty with. And when you have got a recent activity to clean a bounty with, all you want to do is you want to go and hit start G to online. You'll get two error messages guys, there will be one saying are you sure you want to return to trailer, you want to just decline them both. And when you have done this, all you want to do is you want to go to special characters. And you want to select a special character called Jesse. When you do have this guys, all you want to do is you want to download the touchpad on the interaction menu. And you want to go up 5 times, then X, then up another time, then X again, and you should be able to walk around. When you have got this guys, all you want to do is you want to load into an invite only lobby. Then when you have loaded into the invite only lobby, all you want to do is you want to get start, you want to go to online, and you want to hit swap character. And you want to switch to your female character, as you can see me doing right now in the video. Once you have switched to your female character guys, you will be in this loading screen for in about 2 minutes. It's not that long guys, do not like close GTA 5 or anything like that guys, you just want to wait in the slow screen. And when you have waited long enough, you should get an error message saying the session has timed out, return to Grand Theft Auto 5 and try again later. Uh, just accept that error message guys and from there on guys, you want to wait until you load back into Grand Theft Auto 5 story mode. And you want to go ahead and close your application when you have loaded in the Grand Theft Auto 5 story mode. And when you reopen your application guys, all you want to do is you want to get past the bikini girl, all you want to do is you want to hit L1 and R1 at the same time when you're going for the Rockstar logos and everything like that guys. And when you are doing this, you will get a display calibration, all you want to do is you want to confirm that by hitting X. 
and you want to go ahead and just load in the GTA 5 online story modes when you have loaded in guys all you want to do from here is you want to hit start we're going to go to online and you want to go to invite only lobby you will get rockstar games policy you just want to take that and then submit and when you do load in the GTA 5 online you want to pull your interaction menu up and you want to go into style and you want to just go through the outfits and uh, what you named the outfit as and you should notice that you will have the outfit inside your outfit slot really cool glitch guys and it's really unique as well i got this black checkered outfit uh, tron top which is really cool and unique guys so i do recommend you trying this out for yourself and uh, make some cool com combinations and i will make some more mod outfits as well guys this week but if you did go on and enjoy this video guys, make sure you drop this video a like, I'll subscribe to your channel so you don't see content in the future such as this. And make sure you turn on post notification if you're on YouTube channel guys. But anyway guys, I will see you guys in this video. Peace and have a good day. Peace.